All right, we're at uh, 2437 Moonlight Glen. Uh, we pulled this toilet upstairs in the master bedroom, bathroom, um, and snaked it out. Um, the tenant was complaining that it was clogged up and coming up in the shower, or when taking a shower, it was gurgling in the main line, which is the toilet. So we uh, snaked that out, and we're gonna go ahead and run the camera right now to see what's going on. And the first thing I do see is that it is cast iron, um, which is a little bumpy. It's not terrible. It is holding a little bit of water right here because it's bumpy. kind of closing in a little bit right here but and it's bumpy and then we come straight to the drop so this this pipe is in the ceiling when you're downstairs or or in the floor when you're upstairs um, and then it drops down in a wall somewhere where this is the drop this is a vertical drop and we're going down 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 so we get to the bottom which now we're in ABS. So I think it's a little weird that there's cast iron upstairs, but then it drops down to ABS. I don't know why that is, um, how they built these places, what codes it was. Maybe it's a fire code, I'm not sure. But now we're downstairs in the slab, which is ABS, which is absolutely beautiful. Um, let's go ahead and turn the shower on and we'll see that the water is making it all the way down here. going this is a combination of tie-ins or combos from downstairs toilets and restrooms we're probably at the garage by this point and all of this looks great pretty soon we're gonna run out of cable here we are very far out. There's another tie-in. Those are probably clean outs. It puts us probably in the driveway. And turn. Here comes the water from the shower upstairs. You can see it. That's the only thing we have running right now. And here's the drop to the city. So this is the city, all right? Go ahead and turn the water off. So at this point, we're way out in the street. Uh, just about 100 feet out, as far as 100 feet of linear pipe. Uh, we're gonna start coming back in because all this ABS is beautiful. And I want to look at that cast iron on the way back in. This might be the issue. Especially if this happened once before. That piece of cast iron pipe might not be smooth enough or have enough pitch. And we're getting some soft clogs upstairs. all beautiful pipe all this ABS is beautiful pristine looks great I don't see any issues and this is the trunk in the wall Also looks like it's cast iron. Alright. 
Here is that drop. So now we're in the, this is what's tying in this upstairs master bathroom to downstairs ABS, is this drop right here. And it's a little bumpy. You can see the walls are a little jagged. And uh, if we're getting, you know, large amounts of toilet paper or, you know, fecal matter or whatever, I can see it possibly getting hung up in this section right here, which is why it would explain why it's only affecting this toilet and this shower. And again, you have a little bit of water hanging out up here. Still, that should have been, that should have went downhill, but it's kind of hanging out right there, indicating it doesn't have like the best fall. Other than that, don't see much problems. So, there you go. We'll go ahead and put this toilet back, reset it, new wax rings, and be done.